How's it going guys? I just got in from from a long day at work and um I'm pretty I'm pretty tired, but I'm going to give you all the preview of the of our um the 2018 Dallas Cowboys. First off, we um we all pause to reflect and remember that this is the um, this is the 19th anniversary of the 9/11 terrorist attacks. I was in I was in fourth grade when it happened, and uh, but it's really but after I understood what happened, it's very personal to me. Well, that well, let's let's all let's talk let's uh, get to the get to the chase um as you know this is my first video in probably forever since i was since this pandemic began and the um we weren't sure if there was going to be a football season um it was looking bleak a few months ago but but now it's but now we're going to proceed with football season as normal except for with the exception of that there is reduced stadium capacity and um, all will be wearing masks and um, everybody um, any yeah and also um, the preseason games as you know were um, were scratched so um it's going to be interesting to see what the what the season holds for for all the teams involved and um it's going to come down to which teams adjust to the turbulent off season of covid as you know at the end of last season, the Cowboys officially fired Jason Garrett, which we're all which is a great news. It's um it's a chapter behind us, it's the end of an error. And um he brought in Mike McCarthy, who is um who's a Super Bowl winning coach. He coached in Green Bay and he coached Aaron Rodgers. Um, by the looks of things, if Jerry Jones stays out of, stays out of the way, then we could be looking at a real culture change. I think McCarthy knows what he's doing, and, um, he's gonna have, he's gotta be able to get on the guys who are not, who are slackers, and and discipline them if they if they are not taking initiative which is something that has consumed this organization for 25 years last time the Cowboys won the Super Bowl I was in preschool and I wasn't a football fan I wasn't watching football I didn't know much about football but it's been it's been way too long Hopefully, only time will tell if McCarthy is a coach who knows what he's doing or if he's just another one of Jerry Jones' puppets. Hopefully, it's that Jerry has finally decided if I want to win, I got to I got to hire a real coach and let him have discretion of football and and I only need to worry about the business. That being said, we're going to have a um it's going we're going to have a tough one to start the season. We're starting at the new at the Rams new season at the Rams new stadium in Los Angeles, SoFi Stadium. And we're going to be wearing our navy jerseys in McCarthy's debut. 
that's gonna be a really tough game and also I mean originally we signed Ha Ha Clinton Dix but um for some reason he was um he was released I don't know what it was before the season even started and we hadn't had a chance to see what he would do for us but hmm by the way we got we got ourselves a really a really pot, a, re, a really nice draft pick with CD Lamb out of Oklahoma um he was a sooner he was killing my longhorns but but I'm glad to have someone like him he's a when he was in Oklahoma he was he was um, always like get. He was fast and he was always getting wide open for big plays. And um, he'd been burning defenses deep. We're gonna see what this team. We're gonna see if things change in Dallas, which we're hoping they do. Oh, and by the way, I'm wearing. I got this jersey in the off season. Um, I'm also going to say, Dak, I appreciate what you're doing, doing for anxiety and depression, and I'm sorry about your brother. I cannot imagine what it is like to lose someone, someone so close to you. The only, I mean. I, I haven't experienced anything that he did, but one of the couple of the deaths that were real, were that hurt me that were painful was um, my great aunt about ten years ago. She uh, she had cancer, and uh, before then, ever since I was born, we'd go to see her almost every Friday, and then four years later, when I was in, you know, I was in. I was in my, it was at the, it was on the first day of winter break after my first semester of college. And also, um, my grandfather, my step-grandfather, um, he, um, he died in March 2014 when I was at Texas State, when I was in, you know, when I was in college. So, um, those are the only two, but I cannot imagine how painful what he's going through. Dak, we're very sorry and we're we we cannot imagine what you were going through. And you're in our thoughts and our prayers. Let's see what this season is made of. How about them cowboys? <laughs>